John Oak 0-0 to Boston this afternoon. Some unbelievable chances to win it towards the end. But overall, what's your take from the game? Yeah, firstly, I thought it was a really good game of football, to be honest. I thought we started the game quite well the first 10, 15 minutes. Then we had a spell where Boston um, did really well for about 15 minutes. And then the last 15 minutes of the first half, um, we got back into the game a little bit. I think we had one clear-cut chance first half. Uh, Finn just put it wide in the post, but they've had a couple of chances. A shot from the striker, I think Wits made a double save. And then um, across from the left back who got to the bad line, which it right across and they had a chance. Um, but the first half was probably a little bit even. But I thought the second half, we came out and, um, you know, we caused them all, all sorts of problems, really. They made a sub, took Hazel off, changed shape. That's how well we were doing. And uh, like you said, we've had chances to win the game. I think um, Cole's had a couple, Greeny's had a couple, I think Finn's had a couple. Um, but we just couldn't put the ball in the back of the net. But overall, the, the performance was very, very good. It's a really good away performance. Just said to the players in there, um, you know, we know we can do it. You know, I've said it all year when we perform at the levels I know the team can perform. We, we can give everyone, anybody a game. Uh, today, we were very, very solid at the back. I thought the defence was superb. Midfield was superb. I thought Cody Johnson was absolutely terrific today. And so we look a threat going forward. Um, just disappointed we couldn't get the ball in the back of the net and win the game. But um, fair play to Boston. They stayed in the game and um, they didn't really hurt us with any attempts at our goal, really, in, in the second half. But um, I think overall, we probably deserved a win. Yeah, and you mentioned last week about experimenting with your squad for the for the last two games. Without giving too much away tactically, obviously, do, do you think the players gave you what you asked? For yeah, them yeah, do? absolutely, absolutely. Um, you know, we wanted to try and give all the outfield players a start um, in the last two in, in the last two games, and um, we wanted to try people in different positions. We tried te- uh, finning the ten today. Um, obviously, Don plays left or right anyway, but. Um, Ollie at right back again, who I thought was really good. Um, but I did tell the players the other day that um, I wanted to try, you know, different players, try and get minutes into different players. Um, but that's not to say we didn't want to win both games, you know. And I, I think you've seen from the performance today that we definitely tried to win the game. Um, we've had numerous chances to win the game. And like I said, second half with a better team. And we wanted to put a performance on for the fans. We said to, to the players before the game, listen, I think there's three coaches coming down today. Or come come fancy dress. They've really put effort in, and we we owed all the all the fans a, a really good performance. And I think the fans will be good home, proud of how the boys played today. Um, like I said, we're lucky not to get the win. Yeah, well, one left to go now. Next week, Alfreton at home, another tricky game to end the season, but one that should be a good occasion as well today. Like you mentioned, our travelling support is brilliant. Yeah, it'll be a similar message next week. You know, whatever team we pick, whatever players we pick. Um, there's a lot of performances there today, probably guaranteed starts for next week, but we've already said that we're going to give minutes to players. Um, but like I said, doesn't mean we're, we're not trying to win the game. Alpha to will be a different uh, kettle of fish, you know, um, a little bit more direct, a little bit more physical. We have to take that into play. Um, but we'll be putting a performance in, hopefully like today, over the 90 minutes where we can be defensively strong and organised and committed and looking good going forward and um, this time hopefully try and get the ball in the back of the net and finish off with a win and make all the fans happy. Um, I'm sure it'll be a big turnout because it's the last game of the season for probably, what, 12 weeks till pre-season, maybe longer. So I'm sure the fans will come down and support the boys in the last game and um, we can put a good performance on and then we can celebrate with the fans after the pitch. Cheers, Donna. Okay.